Okay guys, back again, back again on another video. Today I'm doing an unboxing. I already started opening the box as you can see. Somewhat. This is a long box as you can see. So you probably know pretty much what it is, right? <laughs> you don't get figures that come in long boxes like this. So, um, you know, as I lift up the bubble wrap, packaged pretty well. You can see. Styrofoam, well, bubble wrap, not styrofoam. And bang, you can see factory packaging in this thing. Can you guys see this right here? Hot Toys, MMS 177, The Dark Knight, Rises, and that is the bad pod, guys. I never thought I would own one of these things, especially after price hike in these bad boys once they sold out everywhere but I'm actually getting the unbox one with factory packaging wow <laughs> that's awesome so I guess it is good it's good and a bad thing when you reissue the best thing is if you missed out sorry for the camera bouncing around too guys if you missed out on this bad boy, that's the bad part. The good part is if they reissue, you get to catch up on it. And here it is, guys. Um, I paid two seventy five for this. Yep, two seventy five, two seventy five. I'm looking for my blade. Get some physics down here. All right. 275 for this bad boy, and that's about retail pretty much. You know, the cheapest I've seen it maybe was like 265 or something. So, um, you know, it's cool. I would have to pay that. Then, uh, certain places I've seen this thing go for every bit of uh, $400. And I'm like, it just came out, they just re released it. Damn, like web, uh, eBay, they're trying to kill you on the price over there. Man, it ain't no love for a toy collector. <laughs> for real, guys. You know, we don't get no special specialness at all. You know, no special days, toy collector day, half off prices. Guess it's a business, and that's what you guys say, but i don't know at the end of the day what if all toy collectors realize you know what i'm not spending no money no more in these prices it's too crazy you know whatever you collect premium format uh one six scale figures one fourth scale because um you know pricing is crazy guys but i don't want to keep ramming but here it is guys packaged in its factory packaging Box is looking factory fresh. Yes, it is. And it has a handle. So if I can get it out. Ooh, look at that. Look at this box. Let's get this box out of here. <laughs> Shit falling and everything. So here you have the broken bat. They are definitely running with that logo for the uh, Batman, the Dark Knight Rises. As you can see. So this is basically all new packaging from the first time around. Um, trying to see where we open this bad boy. Got DC Comics over in the side corner. And it's just black box. Just black box, guys. So let's, how about if we open it right here. Let's see. Get my razor. But, um, guys, I know you guys are going to say, you know what? You are too funny because I said I wasn't going to get the bang. And I'm having second thoughts, guys. Oh, snap. This is actually, I guess, the extra protective box. So this box is, so you got the bat pod box, which is going to be right here. Then you got this outer protective box, like I guess a slip cover.
And then you have the factory packaging. So this thing is actually boxed pretty well. So that's pretty cool. And look, check it out. They even add the new plastic bag over, you know, the original box inside there. So again, Hot Toys is definitely listening and they don't want us collectors complaining about boxes. So one strike for us. <laughs> One strike for us, the collectors, you know what I mean? This is thorough that now they're definitely starting to do this. So I hope they keep it up because I think it really protects your box. So with that being said, I'm going to have to, let me see, how can I open this? I think I'm going to have to slip it out, guys, so bear with me for a second. I'm going to sit this iPhone down right here. Luckily, I have that flat surface of the iPhone because it ain't going to fall. At least I hope it don't fall. This is too cool though. But yeah, guys, like I was saying, I'm going to get the Bane. I think you, I ain't even going to fry. I'm getting the Bane. I ain't going to say I think. You know, I have a few minor issues, but you know, that's just how it is when you come with these collectibles. When you collect these collectibles, and um, I'm a completist to be honest with you. I like to complete the different lines that I enjoy, like the Iron Man's and the Batman. So it's almost like a must get. For real, for real. But I just was sorry that Hot Toys, I don't feel like they put in their blood, sweat, and tears into that one. And they should have, you know? So, I don't know. Maybe it's cool with a lot of you guys. And y'all like, what the hell are you complaining for? But at the end of the day, that's just me. You're looking at a hardcore one six action figure collector. So, you know, we're going to have our complaints. Oh, fuck! No! <laughs> Oh, I ruined the outer shell, guys. Damn, look. You guys see that? Can you guys see that, guys? The tape or something just was ripping it, and I didn't even notice. Oh, man. Oh, well. Next time you lose some. Damn. Still, this is the main box anyway right here. At the end of the day, this is just a... You know, outer box. But that shit was just ripping for days, guys. Because it is plastic. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. This is the main box. This is what's important. And here, bang, baby. The bat pod. Can you guys see that? Let me pick up. Oh, shit. Sorry, guys. The bat pod. There you go. Wow, this is a different box compared to the last box. It's like a hundred boxes here. I mean, you got like, when are we gonna get to the damn bat pot? But hey, I'm opening them up, guys. I'm getting there. This is a true unboxing. You better be lucky that I already pre un pre unboxed this bad boy from opening up the front first box. So here we getting here. We're getting to the bat pod. As you can see, opening this up, you got the handle. It's pretty cool, carrying handle. And here is the bad pie, guys. It's coming. It's coming, guys. It's coming. Ooh, what is that? This is the, I guess, the cape blower. So you can put it on your Batman and make the cape like it's blowing in the wind. Okay. What is this? I don't know what that is. Um, here is the instructions. Alrighty. Let's see if I can lift this up with one hand. Probably not. Probably not. Yes, I can. It's tape. Alright, so as you can see, the box is cool. And now we have the styrofoam that we got to get through. So I'm going to open it like this. This way up, this way. Hopefully this is the right way. I'll check it out before I fully open it. So the, this thing is protected very well. Which is good, I assume, because um, you don't want to, this thing is fragile and you don't want to damage any of the parts. And next thing you know, you're sending this bad boy back. So hopefully we won't have no QC issues inside here. The way this thing is packaged, everything should be good. 
All right, so here we go, guys. Ooh, the bad pod. And I opened it up from the right way. Yes. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I can already see before this bad boy is out. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful 1-6 craftsmanship. Oh, my gosh. Let's get it out, guys. Oh, I don't want to open it up from there. I want to look from there. Hold on, guys. Let me put this on the table again.